Is that everything? Hopefully. This is not the music I was hoping for. I'm sorry. We need the Sims 4 OST, to be honest. What is it? Realm of Magic? OST. I feel like Sims 4 has better music for expansion packs. Or maybe that was wrong of me to say. Why isn't the full OST here? Excuse me, I don't want a playlist because you're going to give me ads. Um, um, I really should have set this up before. <laughs> oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, I found it. No, don't give me an advertisement. You are not getting free ads on my stream. Thank you very much. There we go. Emma, thank you so much for the sub. Ew, four months. Oh my god, has it really been four months? Thank you. Is this FGG? It is. Hello, everybody. How are you guys doing? Hold on. Why did I move this here? This should go in front of me like this. Um, today, I want to take it very chill. I'm very tired. I've been changing my sleep schedule, actually, so that I wake up at 8 in the morning. Because I've been, for the past year, waking up past 1 p.m. So, I'm very, like, spacey. You know, I am not... I am here, but my god, my eyes feel so heavy. So, I wanted to... Well, actually, I have to build something for a project I'm doing, actually. I'm not going to say any more than that. Actually, I will tell you, but not right now. I'll tell you later. But basically, I need to build these things. So, I was like, I'll just build them on stream. And that is what we're doing. You're going to carry them for me. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Hi, Kribby. Welcome. It's like you knew I needed this. Well, I did actually. That's the whole reason. Everything I just said was a lie. I'm only doing it because the egg needed a stream. And he didn't, the, the egg didn't even tell me. I just assumed. Jonathan, thank you so much for the prime sub. I really appreciate that. How are you? I'm good. I'm very tired. Um, It's weird. I wake up like super early now. And in the morning, I'm like dead. I'm like, I can't move. And then I get this like... I just wake up, right? Like, I'm like, oh my god. My eyes are so open. The world is so freeing. I And I, then I start working. And, like, my edits are so much better now that I've woken up this morning. Thank you so much, Nika Pub. And the hype train. Holy shit. My edits have gotten so much better since I started editing in the morning. Because, like, I'm funnier in the morning. But then I get to, like, 3 p.m. and I'm tired? Is this normal? Are you supposed to be tired at 3 p.m. for those early birds? Fucking advertisement, I know. Thank you, Phoebe, for the prime sub. I appreciate that. You have it too? Okay. It's normal. It's your normal. Oh my god, the hype train. I forget. You know, I really... I should get a soundboard. Because I know I'd be really obnoxious with it. And it'd be fucking hilarious. And every time the hype train would show up, I'd have like a little soundboard that was choo-choo. But it wouldn't be an actual train. It would be someone saying it. Artsy thing! The stream never starts until artsy thing is here. Thank you so much for the bits. I can't stay because the bars on campus have finally reopened and you're fully 5G! Oh my god, go have fun. Forget forget about me. Go day drinking. It's great. The last few days, I've had to wake up early for work and legit by 3 or 4 I'm yawning. It's very normal. I don't think I could live like this. I used to wake up at like 1pm and then I wouldn't even be sleepy by 5am. This is weird. You are gonna sleep, but this is more important. Go to bed. I would love to sleep right now. You're supposed to be working. Sable the noob, thank you so much for the three months sub. You guys are great. Good time zone, ugh. <laughs> I, listen, I didn't know what time of day it was for artsy thing. If artsy thing wants to day drink, go for it. Fully fi listen. Once you're fully 5G and everything's reopened, like, go do whatever. I, I don't care. Like, go have fun. Okay, who cares? Day drinking can be normal for later, but the world is not normal right now. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm drinking water. That's all I drink. The only thing I could ever drink. Welcome to the real world. I don't want to be here if it means I'm tired by 3 p.m. And you know what? It's funny. I'm saying I'm tired. Hold on. My cables are all fucked up. I'm always like, oh, I'm so tired. Well, of course I'm going to be tired because I'm always in a blanket. Always. What was that notification? Thank you, Zephyron, for the bits. I really appreciate it. Like, of course I'm tired. My boy, like, I remember, like, I would not sleep because I have, like, reoccurring insomnia. And then, like, 
I would be lying down and I'd be telling my boyfriend, I can't stay awake. I'm so tired. And he'll be like, it's because you're lying down. And I was like, oh, that's why. So <laughs> a stream, I know. And Platt, thank you for the bits. So oh, you missed my streams. Yeah, I missed streaming. How do you feel about these new kits? Your video in this morning was ambiguous. Are we gonna have? Are we gonna go straight into business? Are we gonna talk about business? Okay, let's talk. Let's talk business, gamers. <laughs> My opinion on the new kits. Well, I saw the announce. They announced two of them on Twitter. The first one is like they're both global fit kits. So it's basically just clothing inspired uh, by cultures around the world by like all these different fashion designers from different countries, and like. I don't care about kits. I think it's stupid. I don't like the business practice of it. I think it's really fucking lame. And it feels like obviously it's good for the fashion designers to be able to like share their work and share their culture in a way that is not actual fashion and is digital. And that's cool or whatever. I don't care if you like it like that. That's more for you. But I am not a simmer that spends a lot of time in create a sim. I spent when I make a family, I spend a lot of time. Thank you so much, Aldi Good, getting down to business with the Sims 4 trash talk. It's not trash talk. Okay, listen, listen, hear me out. I I I'm not a type of person that spends a lot of time in Create a Sim. Like I will spend a lot of time on a family when I start one, but then I'll never really go back into Create a Sim again. I don't just make Sims and not play the game. I'm a very gameplay focused person. Like I love new build buy items as well, because I love building, but it's not like I don't care, okay? I don't care about kits. I don't. It's, it just feels like they are selling us stuff that we don't need. Like, I'd rather we just, I don't know. I don't know, man. Have I considered playing Crusader Kings on female preference? Only females can inherit by rulers. Yeah, yeah, I, I, when I play, I try and do that eventually, but you can't really start that way, can you? But I just... Thank you, Angel Witch, for the sub. I really appreciate you guys. You guys are so fucking awesome. I just feel like kids are kind of like, Ooh, we need your pocket money. Oh, you're... $40 for an expansion pack? Not enough. Oh my god, it's Sammy! Emily, thank you so much for gifting out the subs. You guys are insane! And Evil Candy Girl, thank you for all the bits. You guys are fucking ridiculous. I can't stand you. <laughs> oh my fucking god. I just... I don't like kits. And I thought the community agreed that we don't like kits. And it's fine. Some people do. I'm not gonna be like, oh, you're dumb for liking them. I don't give a shit what you like. It's just... It does, it, the, 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 I feel like they're just trying to do it more so it's normal. Like, how when the Sims 4 base game came out, there was nothing in the game. Like, there was nothing. I'm sorry. There was nothing in the base game. And everybody was angry. And then... It's just normal. Like, we were like, yeah, that's just what the Sims 4 is. They're doing that with kits. I'm t Anyway. Wow, I really did get down to business. Let's play the game, shall we? Let me open up the love... I have the game already open. Are you guys proud of me? <laughs> so, um... This is not a particular save. I know that there are saved households and shit. Uh, where was I? Uh, this is my save where I do all my speed builds. Uh, it's just a throwaway save. I just go in here. I demolish shit. I get rid of shit. It's not a big deal. Um, I want to make... How many lots do we have? One, two, three, four, five. I want to make five different lots. I don't know if I'll do all of them on stream. I definitely want to do one of them on stream. That are all spooky themed. Now... Actually, let me let me come back to this. Hold on. I need to get some epic music. What's a good game that has epic music? I'll just go straight for The Witcher. The Witcher music, to be honest, is a bit too intense. But we'll just go Silver Pro Monsters. Easy. Listen, I have an announcement to make, guys. I actually... I, I, I was a bit too... I have a big announcement to make. Um, let's put on... <laughs> I'm just gonna put on some Witcher music, because that's the only epic music I can think of. Okay, it's kind of spoopy, right? No, I'm not pregnant. Shut the fuck up. So, as you know, next month is October. I think the music might be too loud. 
Next month is October, which is spooky month, my birthday month. And I have neglected my Sims content a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not fucking pregnant with your baby, Phoebe. We're adopting. Anyway. I like, you know, you guys like Danger Mountain and Danger Island and stuff. But there's just one series that I feel like we've neglected. I've not gone back to. And I am doing... A Janine Halloween. Yeah. No, not Janine and Bean. We're doing Janine Halloween. And I need to build... Builds for Janine Halloween. You guys aren't even supposed to know this yet. But because you're always on my Twitch streams, I have to let you know. And... No, you're not the... Okay, my pregnancy's been confirmed. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm not pregnant. But... We're doing Janine Halloween. I'm not going to tell you any more about it. I'm not going to tell you what the story is. I just dropped everything. What did I even drop? Oh, that's important, actually. Let me not drop important things that are very breakable. Um, Janine Ween. Oh, Janine Ween is good. Janine Halloween. You guys are great. I'm not going to tell you anything. I'm not going to tell you if Bean's in it or not. And the thing is, don't worry with my memory, I won't remember anyway. That's totally fine. The baby is Janine Halloween. There you go. I've been carrying this secret for a very long time. This music is so fucking good. But anyway, and I need to make builds for Janine Halloween. And that's what we're doing today. And you guys can guess what's going to happen through the builds. You can look at the builds and be like, oh, I wonder what this is. But... I'm not telling you anything. This is going to be a great Halloween. Oh, yeah. I love festive things. The mods are in on it. No, you're... <laughs> Hi, Luana. Also, thank you, Evil Candy Girl, for the bits again. I really appreciate it. Okay. Oh, yeah. Shit. I need some mod. Yeah, I got it. Hold on. I'm getting down to business to defeat the Huns. All right. That should have worked. If it didn't, I'll do it later. All right, away with the scary music now. We're going to put back the lovely build by music because we are going to build the first build today. Now, I am going to go into the vampire lair that I made for the Vitors and I'm going to fucking scrap it because I don't need it anymore. Um. Oh, you can set female preferences in the game? Oh, shit, I'm going to do that then. Fuck that. All right, let's demolish all my hard work. <laughs> And the first build we are going to make is we are going to be making a dollhouse. A creepy dollhouse. But like, life-sized. You know? So we're going to do that. I need to look up a picture of like a Victorian dollhouse or something. It doesn't have to be Victorian, but I'll just look at dollhouses. Um, no, I probably should look up Victorian because I kind of want it to look old-timey, but like... The problem with that specifically is that if I don't look at Victorian ones, then they're all going to look Barbie. And that's a bit too bright for me. So we actually have to work on the back of the house first. So let me, I just want to open this image. I have a reference image here. And we're just going to get to it. Get into it. Um, you guys can guess all you want what the fuck the dollhouse means. But I'm going to make it like the t typical like three story thing. Uh, dollhouse change into debug, baby. No, stop it. Don't bring up any debug anything. I've never built a life-size dollhouse before. Ever. I was about to say in The Sims, but as if that would make a fucking difference, whether it was in The Sims or not. Uh, I'll make it into a room first. Because I want to look, like, into it so it's, like, completely open. Thank you, Evil Candy Girls, for the bits again. It's a Lego dollhouse. Oh my god, here we fucking go again. Uh, or should we make it two-story? Two-story is fine. I can live with two-story. Uh, so this is actually... The confusing thing is this is going to be the front of the house. Like, the fake front. And then it's going to be open from this side. And I'm thinking because I want it to still... I don't want it to have bad lighting. So I'm going to have it be, like, windows on this side. It's weird. It's really weird. They're not going to get any fucking privacy at all. Whoever lives in this dollhouse. I, I'm going to end up spoiling shit, aren't I? Unintentionally. Alright, like that. Use the actual build house. Ah, uh, the actual dollhouse for, as inspo. That wouldn't be so bad. I've got a good reference image, to be honest. 
But the thing about the actual dollhouse... See, there's this one. I don't like this one. This is not the vibe I was looking for. Isn't there another one? There isn't. Oh, there's this one. I don't want that one. Oh, I have to sneeze. No, 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 no. I am not sneezing. I will hold in this fucker. Actually, this kind of looks bad already. It looks like a modern fucking house. Not a fucking house. A house specifically made for fucking. I just mean like a expletive house. I hate this house. <laughs> I'll just put it in for now. It's fine. I, I don't have to be tied down to anything in my life. Oh, you know what? I have to do something real quick. Let me just manage word worlds. Worlds? Words. The others are in kids. Oh. Okay. I'm a dumbass, apparently. I need to evict the Votoris. <laughs> you saw a pretty house once. That's good. It's a shame that you've only seen one pretty house. Okay, so we have this one. We have... Oh, this one's like a castle. These two are castles. Let me change the fucking lighting. It's too dark. Yeah, no, I don't like these. They're just castles. I mean, this one's like... Yeah, I guess it's more of the inside are just a bunch of boxes. That's really interesting, actually. So I can make the rooms boxes. But I just want to focus on the outside for now. Um, so we'll just get rid of these real quick. I want to make the back of the house. I'm very quiet. Oh. She sounds fine to me. Yep. I've stopped, um, putting my volume up super loud so that everybody can just fucking turn up their audio because nobody could hear the music, so. We're good. We're good. Just turn up the volume if I'm too loud. My gosh, you guys. Did you forget? Did you forget you have a volume button? <laughs> I know you're used to listening to me, uh, very quietly because I'm always really fucking loud. But times have changed. I'm a new woman now. Nice new Twitch profile picture. Thank you. I appreciate that. The fucking sass on this lady. Listen. I am very sleepy. <laughs> so I'm gonna be fucking sassy. Live with it. Uh, then we're gonna have a deck. Someone's at my door and I am not answering. It's none of my business. Are you guys ever like that? Like, you probably even have, like, an important package from the Am Amazon and you just don't want to answer. You're like, well, I guess I'm not getting my package today because I'm not answering the fucking door. And you know how, like, celebrities have a lot of problems with fans showing up on at their door? Like, first of all, that's fucked up. You shouldn't go to anybody's house, let alone a celebrity, without their permission to let you into their house. Like I said, not even celebrities, not even regular people. But... I probably wouldn't even have that problem because I'll never answer my door anyway. Joke's on you, your volume's on max and you're still quiet. Someone's at my door, I'm not answering. You take my joke back. You have a video doorbell which lets me decide who to ignore. I highly recommend- oh, That would be amazing! I, I really want to get one of those to be honest, but I'll still not answer. I'll be like, oh shit! It's the Amazon guy! I need my package, but I'm not opening the door, so I just won't answer. It's fine. Like, all my life troubles are not even trouble anymore because I just will never answer my door. Do I want to put this here? Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, so, and then we need to put, like, a, a roof. A roof. Do you guys say roof or roof? Some people say roof. Roof. Like a dog. Roof. You know? Jeff Bezos? Yeah, Jeff's at my door again. And I'm not fucking answering Jeff. I don't care how many times he's gonna call me. Be like, oh my gosh, Sarah, I miss you. Sarah, please return my calls. Like, fuck off, Jeff Bezos. It's over. You didn't donate to, uh, to the actual Amazon after you took their name? Like, I'm not gonna be with a guy like you. Yeah, I broke up with Jeff Bezos. I'm not lying. <laughs> Oh my god. You say roof not rough because you're not a dog. Well, you could have fooled me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm so sassy today. I really shouldn't stream on days where I'm like really sassy because I don't want to get myself in trouble or upset anybody. But like, 
I mean, like, my friends know that, like, I could say things to my friends that they would never let anybody else say to them. Only because they know it's me. Like, I'm not lying. I'm just saying. And I'd never say really mean things to people anyway. I'm just saying my friends are kind of like... Not free bait. That sounds really bad. But, like, they get me. Does that make sense? You dodged a bullet. I hear Jeff Bezos sucks. Yeah. If only I dated Jeff Bezos when he was rich. Was he ever not rich? I feel like billionaires are always, like, at some point gonna be rich. This is okay, right? I mean, I'm even if you say it's not, I'm not gonna listen. Sassy is exactly when I should stream. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just put placeholders for now. I really couldn't fucking care less about what the back of this fucking house looks like. I mean, it'll be cool on the gallery for those for those people that don't even watch my streams. Oh, they'll never understand. Do you get rickrolled? But I don't rickroll you. Not anymore. Unless I have, unless I've been rickrolling and I haven't remembered. Like, I have like a bit of a memory problem. Um, and I do not, it, it would be fucking hilarious if I literally couldn't remember shit, but the thing I couldn't remember was me rickrolling people. Like, that's what I do when my brain decides to shut off. <laughs> Maybe you got a small one of a million dollars like a certain other guy who should live on Mars for everyone's sake. No, no, no. Here's the thing with Mars, right? I... I think going to space is important because space here, here listen listen hear me out space space exploration actually helps us down on earth right like they're they're doing medical tests up there and listen I don't trust the governments to kick their asses into gear and stop global warming so we kind of need a plan B however if we were going to send people we don't like into space, don't send them to the cool planets. Mars is really fucking cool. I think Mars is like, it's just so dope. Have you seen pictures of Mars? Have you seen pictures of Mars? Why would you send people you don't like to Mars? Lucky, you're going to be like, hey, you get to go up to space now. It's the cool planets. No. If you're going to send people you don't like into space, you do it. On a spaceship, obviously, because how else are you going to get there? And then, you don't give them a helmet. You guys. You want to fucking give them a house on Mars? Like, you guys are wasting more money doing that. When you could just send them in there, into space, no helmet. What are they going to do? You can't order food up there. Not yet, anyway. Elon Musk will find a way to make be able to order food in space. But until he does that, you now is the time to send billionaires we don't like into space. Oh my god. I want a window. One of these windows. Oh yeah, this house is coming together. Why is this so fucking short? Why does this feel shorter than the other one? Thank you so much, Evil Candy Girl, for the sub. I appreciate that. Have I seen the surface of penis? Why, yes, Emma, I have. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know anything about Venus, to be fair. I've not paid attention. I don't have enough time to be jealous. That's my problem. Ryan! Hello, this is your Adam and Eve delivery driver. I've been knocking on your door for hours. Please answer. No, I... It's okay, I didn't expect my Adam and Eve package to come in today, to be completely fair. Uh, so, that's not my fault. You guys are gonna have to come back tomorrow. And hope that my boyfriend can answer the door instead of me, because I'm still not answering the door. <laughs> Thank you, Ryan, for the sub, though. I appreciate it. This house doesn't look right. I'm looking at my reference image, and let me tell you, this reference image is a pretty sexy house but the one i'm doing doesn't look like that it just it doesn't why oh that actually does not look bad at all have you seen uranus 
Or mine? I've seen neither, to be fair. Do people really just look at their assholes? I don't, I don't know why we're going on this topic now, but do people really? <laughs> Wait, but like, who is the first to look? That's my question. I'm gonna stop now. Like, I'm very, very much, very much tired. And I know I will get onto topics I do not want to get into. Doctors. Well, the first one to... Okay, but, but to extend this, the first one to look was not a doctor. Just saying. <laughs> anyway, unrealistic, unrealistic gamer girl 96. Thank you so much for the bits. What the fuck is this? This is Queen Anne? Is this considered Queen Anne or Storybook? I guess it's a bit of both. I don't understand. Um, help me. I don't... I, what am I doing wrong? Why does this look so bad? Does it look bad or am I being a self-conscious bitch? Maybe this needs to be like really even. I mean, when it's even, it looks fine. Am I overthinking this considering this is the back of a house? I'm overthinking this, aren't I? I mean, just because I am overthinking it doesn't mean I'm going to stop overthinking it. The windows need to be lower. I like the tower. The tower looks nice. It does look nice lower, though. Except these ones, because I feel like you can't see them. No, okay, I'm happy with this now. I think once I add all the details and shit, it'll be fine. Uh. So, I want the house to be red. For no particular reason. There's no story reason as to why this house is red. At all. I'm not going to be dropping hints throughout the entire stream and then not elaborating on any of them. Only for you to watch the first episode and be like, wow, she was actually bullshitting us. And none of the stuff she said actually had any relevance at all. Thank you for the burp, burp compliments, actually. I didn't even... I've gotten to the point where I don't even fucking realize I'm doing it. And I'm waiting for some fucking misogynist in chat to whip up and be like, Oh, did the girl just burp? <coughs> I know, like, shut up. I'm just, I'm really, listen, I'm so happy that my community is so wholesome. And I really appreciate it, but I'm just waiting for the one asshole to show up. Like, the just the guy. Just one guy. That's it. Because it's gonna be funny. It's gonna be really funny. You can't burp, you lady. Who said I was a lady? Who the fuck assumed? I don't like the term lady. You know, I don't like... There are a couple things I don't like. There's actually quite a few things I don't like. I need to change this, because this is not... This isn't working. This is like me and Jeff Bezos. It just wasn't working at all. This is my new headcanon now. Apparently, I have dated Jeff Bezos. <laughs> um, what the fuck was I saying? I don't remember what I was saying. I was going on a tangent. You just want to say that you say cheers every time I burp, like, out loud? Aw, that's so wholesome, actually. There's, like, a thing that Arabs do where we have a word for, like, pretty much everything like we have a word for when you shower like when you're done showering we have like a term we say that's basically like congrats on showering and we have a thing that we say when you sneeze and when you cough and stuff and like english doesn't have that at all and so like when people cough or sneeze i just say bless you and then like people get so like weird like i coughed like Someone will be like, <coughs> and I'll be like, bless you. And they'll be like, I coughed, actually. It's like, so what? Do you not want to be blessed? Do you have a, a, a problem with my hospitality? Isn't there like a thing that I can pull that brings us in a bit more? What? How do you do diagonals? Help? What am I doing wrong? We can just say congrats on showering if you feel the need. It's not the same. You need to complete people to congratulate you on showering. It's sweet, though. 
Sims, bish! Just sub. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Why doesn't English <laughs> encourage your actions? Yeah, it doesn't. My god. Why? I How roofing? The fucking soundtrack ended. I'm starting it again. I'm actually really upset. How do I build? Hi. This is Fake Gamer Girl speaking. Can I speak to a sim guru real quick? I have a question. Why well, yes, Fake Gamer Girl, what is your question? We have our hotline open 24 hours uh, available to Fake Gamer Girl. And I will ask. Oh, oh, I kind of. Oh, 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 I kind of did it though. Uh, yes, hello, Sim Guru. Hi, do you roof? And then they hang up. That would be it. Thank you so much, Evil Candy Girl, for the bits again. You press Control C. Oh, what the fuck is this? Hold the fuck! I've never seen this before in my life. What does this do? Uh, gamers. I've never seen this menu before in my life. What the f What is it? Oh, oh, what? The fuck? You guys, I've never, like, sorry, that took me a second. This is weird. How do you guys know this shit about Sims? Sorry, I'm just very shocked right now. I'm, v listen. I am what you could call, and I know people are gonna be like, oh my god, don't self-deprecate, but trust me, I am what you call fucking stupid. This looks dumb, I'm sorry. Like, I tried to get the curve going, but it really is not working at all. Ooh, ooh, I kind of fixed it though, actually. Um, I'm what you call stupid, because my brain feels so fucking slow right now. Like, really slow. I, like, I actually broke on stream. <laughs> I'm sleepy, okay? I stream when I'm sleepy. And I know I shouldn't. But I like it. I, I, and I just, listen, when you have daily uploads and you have shit you want to do, you don't have time for everything. So if I get, like, 20 seconds to stream, I'll take it, okay? You just are getting a, a taste of what it's like. To be around me. And somehow you guys still fucking enjoyed that for some reason. Okay. Uh, this is a very big patio. Or is this a deck? I'm not entirely sure. But this does not look much like a dollhouse. Who peed on the table? At least it looks good. Okay, if you guys say it looks good, I'll fucking take it. I'm not gonna... Sit here and complain. Like, oh my god, my build! <laughs> I got a roof on this, bitch. I can humble brag. It's fine. You're suddenly seeing how much we're like, yeah. That's the unfortunate bit. It's, it, you know, I don't like the red anymore. I think it's the red that's putting me off. The, the, that's the sad thing. Of, if you look at me and you're like, oh my god, that's exactly how I am. I'm so sorry. You don't deserve to, like, relate to me like this. It's not healthy. <sighs> I'm sure once I add, like, flowers and shit, it'll look nice. It's this bit that kind of concerns me. Like, look how ugly the inside looks. It's okay. You know what I have to do, actually? I'm going to extend this. And then I'm going to put a wall right here. This is all fake. None of this is real. You can't actually get in this way. Um, yeah, pretty crazy, I know. This is all going to be a fugazi, fugazi. It's a woozy, it's a wazi. You know what I mean? Trust the process, mom. Yeah, I know. I really know. I That's why I don't panic too much, but sometimes I'm like... I'm not... Okay, I'm the type of builder where I... I look at a build, and I'm like, okay, 
This isn't really going my way right now, but I'll trust the process. And then I'll continue to trust the process. And then halfway through, I will realize my mistake, whether it's with, like, the way the building looks or something. And I will just not fix it. Because I can't be bothered at that point. It's like, well, I didn't catch it earlier, and I sure as hell didn't catch it now. I just caught it now, so I'm not going to do anything about it. So that's why I try to, like, overthink early, because I know myself, and I know that I will not fix it. It's not red anymore. It's yellow now. I've decided. I've changed. Remember when I said, oh, it being yellow, uh, it being red is actually very important to the plot of a Janine Halloween? That was a lie. I lied again. <laughs> That's all I'm going to do to you today is lie a whole bunch. No, I don't like that. I think we just need some good ass. Good ass greenery. I was going to just leave it as we need some good ass, but... I think we can remain assless today. What am I saying? <laughs> there we go. Ah, no, no, more, more up. I want to be able to see it, but it looks raw. Oh no! Actually, when you look at it like this, it looks great. If you need good ass, just hit Kribby up. Kribby does have good ass. I'm not, I, I will, I will say that now. Oh, if you size these down. Oh, I'm a fucking genius. Wow, I'm spending a lot of time for something I'm never going to fucking look at. <laughs> Do you ever think that? Like, it was like me and my Animal Crossing town. I was just like, wow, I'm spending so much time on a game that I'm never going to pick up ever again in my life ever. And I've wasted so much time. Just... Being so finicky and putting individual tiles down when I'm literally never going to look at this game again, ever. And I haven't. I haven't played it in a year. Actually, that's a lie. I did play it again. And I, um, I opened it. And then everybody was like, oh my gosh, where have you been? It's been so long. I missed you. And then that just gave me anxiety and I turned it off. Like, I hate that it's real time. That's the one thing I hate about Animal Crossing. And I know that's the big, like, fucking thing with Animal Crossing. Where everybody's just like, oh, I love it because, it, like, life changes with me. And it's like, no, I just feel anxious now. Like, I have to check every day. And if I miss a day, then I have to try time travel back. So it's like I didn't miss anything in the store. Because maybe that item that I really wanted in the store isn't there anymore. And it just, it's too much. It pisses me off. Okay? I'm going to be fucking honest. You know what? Fine. Fuck Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing fucking sucks. I said it. You can all unsubscribe now. I don't give a shit. I said, I said my truth. Yesterday, I had the whole thing about Star Wars. And today, it's Animal Crossing. And let me just say, nobody is safe. Nobody and nothing is safe from my anger. Fuck Animal... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Ols, hello? I agree. Fuck Animal Crossing. Oh, Master of Mediocrity. I have a follow-up on my interview from yesterday. I should be back before the stream is over. Oh, ooh, good luck, everybody. Everybody in chat, ignore what I said about Animal Crossing and wish Master of Mediocrity a lot of luck because they had an interview yesterday, a job interview, and chat was, like, very supportive. So you get that. I believe in you. Kick ass, but don't actually kick anybody's ass. You will not get the job. I've tried and tested that, and it did not work. So do that. Good luck. Yes, I love our chat. I know some people will be like, wow, this chat's really wholesome, but I actually, there's another streamer that I watch that has an even more wholesome er, chat. That's a fucking lie. I'm sorry. We have the best chat on Twitch. That's all I'm going to say. You'll kick someone's ass. You're very testy today, Emma. Like, are you okay? And I feel like I'm enabling your your testy behavior. And that's fine. I don't mind. I just want to know. Okay. This looks slightly better. But something is off about this. Oh. I think I know what's off about this. Is it this? I think it's this. I actually, I think I just need the round bitch. Sometimes 
that's your solution in life. You're struggling? You need a round bitch in your life. Why is it uneven? Why does it do this to me? How- <coughs> I choked on air! How am I supposed to do this? Hello? Hello? It's like- it's like it doesn't go on the right spot. At all. Hello? Hello? Like, look at it! It's like- It's slipping! Use the other roofs. I want to use this one. Why should I fucking have to use a fucking bullshit ass octagonal, octagonal, octbitchinal? It's still off center. Why? Look at it. It's like, you know, it's like, ooh. why? Make the tower more round. I'm not moving the tower. I'm not moving that. This is the thing that I said earlier. I need to save. I have not saved this whole time. This is what I said earlier. I will not fix my mistakes past a certain point, and we are past the point of no return, gamers. Go back one. I did. Look. And then it's like that. And then I move it. It does. It doesn't. So then I pull it back out, and she's fucking slumping again. I hate this. What about the Pentagon, huh? Is the president gonna fucking help me? Probably fucking not. Huh? No! Look at that! Look at that! I'm not slight I'm not changing the size of the tower. I guess the impossible does exist. Yeah, and it's always on my fucking stream. Always. And I know I'm saying that, and I don't watch anybody else's streams. Not really, because I don't have time. And some people be like, well, actually, this happens to blah, 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 too. Like, no, it fucking doesn't. Why did I? Well, I guess we're going back to that roof I fucking hate. Because that's all we've got. This is all we've got, gamers. Six sides roof, then. There is... Oh, my God. Uh... I need two parts. I... You guys do it! I'm a- uh, listen, I'm the type of bitch that will upload this to the gallery and I will sit and wait for one of you fuckers to fix it for me. And then we can continue on with our day. I'm not doing that. I'm not wasting my time. Okay. I am impatient. This is why I couldn't paint with watercolors. When I was young, because I just couldn't fucking wait. You're supposed to sit there, and you're supposed to wait patiently for the watercolors to dry before you can do anything else with the watercolors. And I did not do that. At all. I decided that that is a, a huge fucking waste of time, honestly. Is there gray? I need gray. And I bet there's not going to be 50 shades of it. There's only going to be a few. I'm not going to count them, but that looks significantly less than 50. I've referenced 50 shades of gray a lot this month. And I've I've not read it and I've not like watched it since it came out and I've just it's just living in my head rent free, I suppose. Fuck watercolors. I fucking hate watercolors. Watercolors are like listen if you know how to do that, like, power to ya, but I fucking hate watercolors. It doesn't make sense to me. They're, it's like, be patient? Be patient? Wait for the thing to dry? Excuse me. Do you know who you're talking to? I will brute force my way through anything. Especially watercolors. You hate a lot. No. Yeah. <laughs> I just, I've, I struggle a lot. You're doing great, sweetie. I love the condescending chat. It's my favorite. Stay hydrated. I'm gonna add a little bit to this side. Maybe. E. E. Like. That. Mmm. Uh, um, mm, that's too big. Now it's too long. Goldilocks, chill the fuck out, maybe. <laughs> I d 
Is this like a, maybe this won't work. Maybe it won't look right anyway. Maybe I've just gotta do it like this. Question is, how do you actually enter this house? I might have to put like a little like slide door that is the actual door. So chat, I'm very curious cause I, I don't have to justify why I'm curious. I don't know why I was like, I had to have a cousin there. Um, what do you think this house is gonna be used for? Why is there a dollhouse in a Janine Halloween? What's, <laughs> what's that about? Like, wow, that's so random. <laughs> have I saved recently? Now I have. Sadistic reasons, Eliza and Judith. Breed and cheese. Oh, bread and cheese. I thought that said breed and cheese. <laughs> I am so fucking stupid. Free will and then murder, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> I really couldn't begin to presume what's going to happen here, if anything at all. I mean, that's like a big assumption to make that anything would even fucking happen here. This really don't look right. That does, though. Yeah, I can live with that. I don't care. I know some fucking architect in chat is going to be like, I can't believe she just added that to the side. Oh my gosh, no wonder women can't play video games. Breed and cheese. A Janine Halloween, a Janine Easter, a Janine Valentine's, a Janine New Year's Day, a Janine birthday, a Janine Mother Father's Day, a Janine back to school. Yeah, no, I am not Target. I don't know how. Actually, I do know how. I was gonna start a sentence that I immediately knew the answer to. But, like, you know how corporations are so on point with, like, every single holiday you could imagine? Like, even the ones that aren't even holidays. You know, they're just like, we gotta, we gotta have a thing out for Christmas right away. And then they start doing it before Christmas. I can barely keep up. Okay, the amount of, like, things that I have to fucking do to just to set up a Janine Halloween is fucking insane. And I'm not complaining, because I love it. It's just, it's a lot. And corporations are just, like, all the time. And obviously, I was about to be like, how come they can do it? And I can't. Well, it's like, because they have... A uh, bajillion people. That door's not even... Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, we'll have to have, like, a little thing here. Um, I'm just myself. I do everything. So, that makes a lot more sense as to why it's like that. But still, my fucking God. America does Black Friday. Yeah. Yeah, that... I've never... Black Friday never meant anything to me because, like, I just never went anywhere on Black Friday because it's scary. You ordered a skirt? Yeah! I'd like to see the skirt you ordered. Okay, and we have the outside pretty much done. Uh, I might, I might, actually, we'll do some landscaping. I'm not gonna not do landscaping. Because... Builds just don't look right unless you landscape. And I find it very, like, kind of creepy. I wanted to make it... Part of me really wanted to make this a creepy house. But I think it's creepier that there's this really perfect doll... Life-size dollhouse in the middle of Creep Town, you know? Do I ever use debug landscaping? Sometimes. Not very often, though. And I don't do it very often because... I don't like sifting through all the menus and I get confused and lost and usually okay because when I build 90% of the time it's for a video and I try when I do my speed builds to cut out any of me fucking around like testing shit out and messing up and sifting through menus so I just avoid debug because it means it's just less for me to do later you know. Does that make sense? I mean, it fucking better, but... <laughs> the bright yellow is very scary in the environment. Yeah, it's supposed to be a dollhouse. But, like, a life-size one. I don't know how I'm doing the back yet, which is probably why it doesn't look much like a dollhouse right now. But I do want to get the dollhouse vibe. And I find it also creepy that this is the part that's 
facing. Unless it shouldn't. Unless it's creepier if I have it this way. I feel like it would be creepier. And then you come, and then here it's actually a dollhouse. Yes! I'm doing that now. I care that you're back, yikes, Sims. There was an actual house in Sims 3 Supernatural that was based on a dollhouse. Was there really? I never played with any of the townies or cared about any of the townies in Sims 3 because I was a kid and I just spent my entire life in fucking Creed of Sims, so. There you have it. Yeah, no, it looks so much better facing this way. Because then it'll, you, you can't even get in the house. Oh my god, we could put like a fake living room or something. Or like fake people being like, hello. And it's not actually. A house, so creepy. So very creepy. Alright, let's do that. At least the music is wholesome. We need a Sims for Supernatural pack now. I know! Wholesome LGBT Castle Dollhouse Edition? Maybe. It's like the opposite of Edward Scissorhands, where instead of a bleak, spooky house in a lovely neighborhood, it's a lovely home in a bleak and spooky neighborhood. Yup, pretty much. I've never seen Edward Scissorhands. And I already know that for some fucking twisted reason, I would find him sexy. <laughs> so we're just gonna leave it at that. Do I need some rocks? Who gives a fuck about rocks, honestly? Um, we'll add a nice little path here. I don't like it because this is so bright green, but the rest of it isn't bright green. So the paths are just difficult. I'll have to do something like that. And then some like lovely outdoor furniture. Like, just like the stereotypical shit. Yeah, like just a regular... What's it called when like... I guess it's a trap. This is a trap. Or is it? I lied earlier, so I could be lying now. Who knows? But it gives me the vibes of a trap. No, but usually they're like against the wall right oh my god stop selecting the pillar yeah we'll just do it like this i think this looks a lot better and then we'll put some like a welcome mat that's like come in please but you actually can't because it's a fake door it's not even a real door you know a facade yes thank you this is a facade i'm very good at the english language the language that i speak predominantly I won't say it's the only language that I speak, but it's the only one that I'm currently speaking right now, and I still don't know how to fucking say anything, despite it technically being my first language, but I still don't know how to fucking speak English. What a wonderful world we live in. And... Plant? This way. No, this... Yes. Oh, it's such a cute house! There can't be anything wrong with it at all. Okay, good night, Nika Pup. I'm glad that you were able to catch the stream. Maybe like a lovely little like... <laughs> Welcome, family, laugh, love, home! And because it does take place during Halloween, should I put Halloween decorations up? Or maybe it would be creepy that these guys don't even acknowledge Halloween. Whoever lives here. If anybody even lives here. If anybody's even real. Like, I wonder why I'm building this for a Janine Halloween. Maybe none of these builds are actually going to be used in a Janine Halloween. And I'm just doing this to generate hype for something that's actually going to be incredibly underwhelming. But it won't affect me at all because the Sims do it all the time. And you guys still buy their packs. So, I mean, this is like A plus marketing, isn't it? Am I okay? No, I'm not. <laughs> Oh my god. I am... No, no, no. I am okay. 
But I'm not. <laughs> no, but seriously, I am. I'm just, I get like sleepy loopy. Like, I feel like lately my brain has just not been working the way it's supposed to. And not in like an alarming way. I think, I literally think this is all down to me changing my sleep schedule and my brain is just like not having it. And also there's just this thing about when I build, I'm so hyper-focused on what I'm building that I don't even think about what I'm saying. So absolute bullshit just comes out of my mouth. Which is, like, maybe this is, like, the equivalent of drunk me, because drunk me is like this. So when I'm building, I am essentially drunk. <laughs> okay, she says on the border of a fucking breakdown. I'm fine! What, am I not acting like myself? Don't answer that question at all. Should we put some playground items out front? Here's the thing, the rule for good horror, 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 spooky bullshit, is children. Children are scary. Listen, everything is fine, but then you see like a kid in the middle of the night being like, I'm thirsty, mommy, can I have a glass of water? And you just fucking run, fuck that, that's scary. It's water, I'm not drinking. <laughs> I just, I'm drinking water. Do you want to smell it? Creepy swing. Do they? Oh, this game does have swings, don't they? All right. I think we need something a bit more on brand. No, not a fucking advertisement. You do not get free ad revenue, stupid. I'm not even going to say what this is an advertisement for because it's none of my fucking business. There we go. We're putting the Sims 2 music back on. I don't like wine. Don't ever, ever say I drink wine. I know that everybody says I have wine, aunt energy, which is fair. I, I, I agree. But I tried wine the other day. For not the first time. I've tried wine before, but I was like, it's been years since I've tried wine. I'll try it again. And it turns out it still tastes like fucking ass. It's gross. Wine is fucking disgusting. And I will never drink wine again. It's fucking gross. And like there was like a, if we tried like, uh, there was one wine that I liked, barely. And then we tried like a rose, cause it's supposed to be sweet and it tastes like fucking, that's what it tastes like. Uh. Tequila. I've never tried tequila. And I don't use custom content. The only custom content that I use is Pose, pose Player, but I just, just, that just triggers animations and it helps me with machinimas and with thumbnails and shit like that. I, the alcohol that I like, and I don't really like alcohol. Like, I, like even if it tastes really good, I don't like alcohol because it makes me really sleepy. And then when I'm sleepy, I get like this, which is essentially you're just experiencing drunk gamer girl. <laughs> and I only like cider and i like honeyed whiskey that's it most people don't even like whiskey and i like whiskey i've never tried rum though i just don't try alcohol because i don't see the point because even if i do like it i'm not gonna drink it because it's just it's just gonna make me drunk and i don't like being drunk i don't even like being tipsy i don't like the experience okay do I need, even need to put lights there? No. All right, so this is the dollhouse exterior. I think it looks pretty cute. Yeah, wine is, you'd expect wine would taste sweet, but it's not. It tastes like ass. And the annoying thing is that like, like, it just everything tastes like alcohol. Why am I doing that? Everything tastes like alcohol, and it turns out I don't really like the fucking taste of alcohol. So, like, I can't drink alcohol because it tastes like what it is, you know? Alright, let's put these evenly-ish. 
I say evenly, and we're just gonna get some uneven bullshit. That's about right. And then we'll do it again up here. So we're gonna have six rooms. Did I do the math right? Yeah, I can fucking count. Don't worry about it. I went to school and it did nothing for me. Oh, do you guys see it behind me? I have a fish tank, by the way, right there. Oh, wow! <laughs> Slow Raccoon32, thank you so much for the prime sub. Uh, there's no fish in it, though. It's right there. Right there. There's no fish in it. But I have a fish tank now. Because apparently, you can't just buy fish and stick them in the fish tank. You have to, like, wait for the fish tank to be ready. So, I'm excited. We're gonna get fish, and then they'll be on stream forever, and you can always see my fish. Yeah, you need to do the prep work and stuff. I didn't even know that. Okay, so... Because this is a dollhouse, all the rooms are going to be separated by doors. No hallways or anything. We're going to put a ladder right here because this is how you get upstairs and downstairs. Oh. Oh, that's kind of creepy, actually. That you have access to here. Oof. Oof. Uh, but that's okay. I'm just going to put this here and then there will be a door right there. So we're just going to pop these in. Like, so. So, we need living room, kitchen, something. Bedroom one, bedroom two, bathroom. I don't know what the something is, but we'll figure it out. And I want to look at, let's, let's look at how they have the dollhouses in the game. Oh, wrong one. Look at this. So this one's supposed to be a castle, so I don't want to do that one. This one is empty! Are all the swatches of this empty? So this one has nothing in it. This one's futuristic. So, oh, what about this one? So the furniture in dollhouses are very just like, only what you need. And they're always facing out front. So we'll have, what kind of decor would I put? I don't like CC, that's true. Well, it's not that I don't like it, it's just not for me. Get one of those fishes with a big head. I'd love that. This is fucking creepy. How is it creepy? It's a dollhouse! Didn't you play with dolls as a kid? I did! I'm just trying to think of what aesthetic I'm going for. I know I saved like five times. I'll do it again. Fuck it, I'll do it again just because you were thinking about it. <laughs> I'm just picking fights with nobody at this point. Because I was thinking partially kind of clown-like decor, but also just like too perfect, you know? Just really, everything is just too clean, too perfect. Yeah, live, laugh, love. The live, laugh, love dollhouse. That's what I'm calling it. But like always like very bright and vibrant colors. So you always have, like, the couches facing... They won't even have a TV. Like, I don't even know if anybody does live here, what they'd be doing here. Um, you'd have, like, a table. Definitely you'd have a table. Do townies really get assigned random ass custom content? I thought, like, townies just never get custom content. I thought the game didn't work like that. No, I need something kind of classic. Something like this. Gosh, this music is fucking nostalgic. I might cry. Yes, something like this. And then... You'd have the drapes. The curtains, whatever. Don't fucking sass me. I don't know how to speak English, and I never fucking will. So y'all can take your judgments and stick them up your ass. I'll say whatever words I want. Oh my god, this is a big boy. Oof, nothing's big enough. That's what somebody said. <laughs> Nothing's ever big enough. Aren't the curtains usually on the outside of dollhouses? Hold on. Hold on. I must I must investigate. This one had curtains. Oh, they're on the back. Interesting. 
Literally no one said anything. I know, I'm fighting you guys for no reason. This, like... This is just how things are. This is how things will always be as well. I thought they updated the swatches, but not for this one. Not for the one I actually want. That's fine. That will work. It looks kind of interesting, actually. I actually don't hate this. In fact, I could extend this wall just by a little bit to hide the ladder. There we go. Listen, I haven't had a dollhouse since I was like six, so I really don't know what they look like anymore. No, 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 no. This look okay. Hmm. Ahem. Ahem. I don't know. I don't know. I really brain is thinking too fast. I don't know how anyone lives at this speed. Like, do people actually, genuinely, do people just like are able to think all the time? Genuine question. Like, how the fuck? How the fuck even? I need the right shade of blue. Blue. It's blue passport. Get the blue pussy. That's not so bad. Like, it doesn't have to look pretty. It just has to look like a dollhouse. I don't have to elaborate on that further. What are you wondering? Yeah, oh yeah, what I just said. Yeah, I already forgot what I said. <laughs> are all of you from my Discord? Because it's funny. Did you know I had a Discord server? Yeah, it would be really crazy if somebody dropped the link in there for people to join my Discord server. Like, wow, that would be wild. Like, I can't even imagine having the time to do that. I can't imagine, like, what a wild time you guys would have if you joined my Discord server. You're from my YouTube. Aw, that's sweet, actually. I wonder if there- it's like always weird to me to consider that there are people who probably found me on Twitch. I don't know why that's like so weird to me, but it is. I want a set of chest drawers. Chester drawers. Chest of drawers. Chester's drawers. Chester, don't drop your drawers. We're in public. Stop that. This. Why? Because dollhouses would. Oh, I hate that it's sticking out. There we go. There you go, there's the link. Emma dropped it, thank you. And then we'll have like a picture. Just some generic ass shit. Like, that's the thing. They don't get too fancy. I mean, that's a very fancy picture, but you know what I mean. Unless you don't, then I really, I don't care. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Uh. There we go. What a cool dollhouse! What would it look like if this was just open? Like a real dollhouse. Like, that's kind of creepier, though. That it's just open. The lighting would be really bad. Which is really sad, but, like... I actually like it a lot more. So we're gonna do that until I change my mind. But it's okay. I always change my mind. <laughs> Cause I'm a woman and women never make up their minds. <laughs> shut up, just shut up. No, no, the upstairs, the roofs, the roofs. Okay, maybe we can fix this. Maybe this is not a lost co- Okay, so we're gonna have to put the walls back because at least upstairs That's really fucking shitty to be honest Like Why do they do that? Why is it mutually exclusive to when you put a fucking thing there? If I put a wall there, don't fucking do anything Fucking bullshit How do people live in these fucking conditions? I wish I never took the thing out because it looks so much cooler when it's open like this. 
Anger. Just anger. Ooh, I could put arches instead of window. Oh, hold the fuck on. I think we have a smarty pants in the chat. Ooh, I don't know, actually. I don't know if that would look good. What about the square ones? We've got these ones, and they kind of stick out, though. It's just like a very weird dollhouse, right? Like, who gives a shit? Oh, it's uneven. Oh, you... Oh, no, it's not. Huh, I'm the fucker this time, not the game. <laughs> I mean, like... No, it's not the same lighting. It still counts it as a window. I mean, it's very interesting that it's open like this. Maybe... Okay, maybe we'll keep the downstairs open, but the... Oh... No even fences! Oh, you're a fucking bitch. You're a bitch and I hate you. I fucking hate that you exist this way. Okay, maybe the upstairs had to be windowed for safety reasons. Because then you could just fucking fall off. Maybe they had an incident. Oh, maybe the spandrels will work. There's a glitch you found that if you put a basement... If you put a basement wall under the house and size up an arch and move it, it makes like a bigger gap. I don't want to gap around the whole thing. Ignore your advice. It's okay. I already did. <laughs> Let's try spandrels. Nope. It brings the bitches out. And I don't want the bitches in my house. It's fine. Thank you, evil candy girl, for the bits. I appreciate that. Half walls. No, I don't want... Ooh. Maybe I do want half walls. Like the smallest little bitch ones, though. You know? Nope! Fuck you! Fuck you, game! <sighs> I have- to I'm not changing the roofs. I've decided I'm not- I'm not. I'm not. I- I-, I Quite simply. To, to be simple about it. Am not. <laughs> Have a good shower, Creepy. But it would be so easy. I think you weren't here for the mental breakdown that I had over the fucking roofs. I'm not doing it. I apologize. Okay. So now that we have living room complete, we are going to go through... This would be... Oh, we could have dining room kitchen because like for some reason people separate those. Let's have like a nice dining room. Oh my god. I'm okay. Remember when you said that? Yeah, I'll say it again. I'm okay. I'm totally fine. Listen, my mood will never be singular. You know, I will have many. All at once even sometimes. Let's make it red. Red's kind of ominous. Like, I would never go to a dining table that was red. That's too much. And only four seats for such a long boy. And then we'll, um... It's not like there needs to be much, because it is... That's the good thing, is the... The, 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 the decor can be so simple! Like Gennaro Contaldo would always say, so simples. It's so simples. I fucking love Gennaro Contaldo, by the way. What a guy. If you don't know who Gennaro Contaldo is, I have to really feel sorry for you that you don't know. Gennaro fucking Contaldo. Like, are you crazy? I'm a simp? Who am I simping for? Gennaro fucking Contaldo? Absolutely. What a guy. Just what a guy. Oh, uh, no, I wanted to put a fake window, but it turns out it would be a real fucking window. Where is the fucking fruit? It's the first thing here, but it's like the tenth thing on this list or something. I always struggle to find the fucking fruit basket. There she is. Wow. How do I decorate? <laughs> I said simple. Oh. Listen, I'm just as tired as you, probably. I make the assumptions. How to sleep and watch stream at the same time? You keep it open and then you fall asleep and you'll retain it in your brain. 
Probably. Probably not, though. Maybe I need another one of these. Maybe this is a theme going on. They really like curtains. These guys, because they don't have actual windows, you know? Cheyenne, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate that. And then make it not red. They're, oh, but we could make it an obnoxious blue, maybe. Not, no, this is Noms. Thank you for the bits. Welcome to the stream. Barbie dollhouse if she wasn't a girl. Yeah. Yeah, I get those vibes. Maybe, maybe not red. Maybe we go, oh, green. Yes, disgusting. That would be amazing. I know some people will be like, oh my god, you don't like green? The, the obviously superior color of the rainbow. Did you not know that green is actually the best color? Because blah, blah, blah. I did not know. And I will continue to be ignorant because fuck green. Very tacky grandma style. It's a dollhouse. Dollhouse have no style. And this really big thing because they didn't dollhouses also have no concept of relative space, do they? Yeah, it's supposed to be a dollhouse. That's the point. We're making a life-size dollhouse for reasons undisclosed. Don't need to worry about why I'm making a dollhouse. It has nothing to do with the announcement that I made earlier. So, yeah. That's what we're doing today. For no particular reason at all. Green is ew. What was the announcement? I don't remember. Gosh. I made an announcement earlier and I just... My memory. <laughs> Blue and orange supremacy. Yeah, okay. You could be wrong. That's fine. Oh my god. I love, like... Because there are people who really take opinions, like, their own opinions about, like, meaningless shit, and they really take it seriously, and that's so fucking funny to me. Like, that is so fucking hilarious. Where it's like, if you don't like that one thing that they like, that's like, oh my god! What do you mean you don't like the color green? You know green is my whole personality, you know? I said you know twice, because I'm just so flabbergasted that you don't like my favorite color? Are you... Are you okay? Like, yes. It's not my fault that your favorite fucking color is ugly as shit. And it's the same color of horse poo. Because sometimes... No, camel poo, actually. Sometimes, and I know this for a fact. Camel poo looks kind of greenish. It really does look green. Can there be a pink room? Maybe. Maybe we'll make the kitchen pink. That would be really cute. I want a good chandelier. Like a low-hanging chandelier. Man. Like... Oh my god, Cheyenne! Thank you so much for gifting a sub. That's so sweet. <laughs> this is the each room's a different color challenge. Not, not strictly, but it is kind of like that. Is there like... Fuck it. We'll just do this one. I don't give a shit. When would I have given a shit ever about anything? I give a shit about a lot of things, to be honest. I should know I'm the camel. <laughs> All right, kitchen. We'll go pink. We'll see if there are... I know that, like, pink's a bit of a lacking color in this game. Oh, I say that. All right, good thing I have a kit. Wow, the kit really did save the day, huh? I don't, the sad thing is, I really like the items in the country living kit. Um, I just don't like the, I don't like that it came in a kit. That's what really upsets me. And I feel like it was the first batch of kits, so I had to buy them, because I was like, well, I don't know what this thing is, so I have to at least look at it. And let me just say, I don't regret purchasing it, because I do use it, but I regret that I like it. Do you guys ever feel that when making purchases, you're like, gosh, I fucking hate that I bought this thing, but I enjoy that I bought it. Life is complicated, and unfortunately, so is capitalism. 
and it upsets me. This is a ugly ass kitchen, actually. Okay, I know what I want to do now. Just do this. Yes, this is so much better. Fuck the country living kit. Fuck it. Just, just, just fuck it. I hate it, <laughs> but I like it. Your feelings about House Flipper purchase. House Flipper is a good game, though. I feel about Island Living, actually. Island Living is hands down my least favorite expansion pack. And I feel like I gauge... I, I was thinking about this the other day. I was like, why, why do I not like certain packs? And then I realized I only care about the gameplay. Like... The world of Sulani, absolutely fucking gorgeous. But when do I go to Sulani? Never. Why? Because there's nothing to fucking do in Sulani. I remember one time, I took... I have a save where it's just me and my girls. My, my girlfriends. And I made us go on, like, a vacation. And it was to Sulani. And it turns out, there's nothing to fucking do in Sulani. It did have so much potential. And it upsets me that it's not good at all. Okay, so we have the downstairs done. This is actually not bad at all. At fucking all. And it's... Oh, it's a lovely little dollhouse! Uh, upstairs, we need to have two bedrooms and a bathroom. And I'm thinking... What am I thinking? Am I thinking... Oh, this, that's what's clipping. Okay, that's fine. I can live with that. There, there's a ladder here. There's a ladder to help you get upstairs. You can, you can actually, this is going to be usable. Very usable, actually. Why is there a door on this side? Excuse me? Why is there a door? Just, just fucking jump off? No, thank you. The mermaids are so boring. They are. They don't do anything. They just are like, I need to take a bath or else I'm going to die. Like, okay. <laughs> Should I have the bathroom here? And the bedroom, bedroom? Yeah, let's do bathroom, bedroom, bedroom. Why the fuck not? I mean, like, there's no privacy in this house anyway. Let's be fucking honest. All right. We're just going to do the generic bathtub in the middle. It is just a fucking dollhouse. I don't have to, like, worry too much about it. I just need to make everything look like generic furniture, if that makes sense. Like that. You have to go to sleep. Well, have a good sleep, Miss Pretty Peachy. Thank you for joining the stream. Even if you couldn't stay for long, I appreciate literally everybody. Is that even... That was even, and then I moved it like a fucking dumbass. I need a towel. They did update all the swatches. For oh, no, not for these towels. These towels already had swatches. <laughs> I was giving them credit where they didn't need it. <laughs> uh, tiles, just regular bathroom tiles. And then we got to pick a color. Maybe yellow. It's a yellow bathroom. Yep. Okay, and then we gotta have a master's bedroom and then a uh, kid's bedroom. So we're just gonna have bed facing one way, not a big deal type of shit. Easy. It's almost 3 a.m. We'll go to bed! I appreciate you, Emma. I really do. I appreciate not only all my Discord bots, but specifically my Discord bots. But every single one of you guys for being here. It's really wonderful that you guys exist the way you do. And it is an absolute blessing that you guys exist at the same time that I do because I wouldn't have been able to appreciate you guys if you were born in like the 1800s because I would not be alive then so it's absolutely wonderful I'm pretty great thank you does the industrial kit have a white swatch on the arch let me check open this fucking kit bullshit it's so so um, it's this one. Yes, it does. It has two. It has two white swatches. There's that one, and there's that one. So there's a clean one and a dirty one. I don't believe in vampires in real life. No. I don't. 
I, if there were vampires, I would have a vampire boyfriend or a girlfriend. I would have a vampire partner. But I only said boyfriend specifically because Edward Cullen. So, yeah, and because I don't have one. And, like, what vampire wouldn't want me to be their girlfriend? So, that's how I know they're not real. Pretty straightforward, to be honest. Such groovy music, though. There we go. So that's the... Oh, I gotta put a painting up. Because it's all, like, facing one way. It's like a sitcom. Everybody's like, oh my god. This is so creepy. It's not. This is just like a sitcom. Calm down. Sitcoms have to face this way. Team Edward. Yeah, listen. I'll get into the Twilight discussion again. I'll fucking do it. No problem. Oh my god. Lest... Lesticia. Thank you so much for the prime sub. I haven't tried vampiresonly.com. What the fuck is vampiresonly.com? Is that a vampire dating site? Yeah, it would be really easy to film in that. Team Edward always. Absolutely. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know if the... Uh, the emotes should be working. But I have... If you are a subscriber, a Twitch subscriber, I have added yay or nay emotes. So that whenever we get to a point in our streams where I need you guys to vote on something, I will ask you guys and then I, it'll be easier for me to see because yay is red, uh, yay is green and nay is red. Um, yeah, those emotes. It's far, it's like farmersonly.com but for vampires. <laughs> That's really funny. Um, so let's test it out. And if you don't have, if you're not subbed, no pressure, you don't have to do that. Like literally all of this is like, I do this for fucking free. Um, so just say yay or nay, or yes or no, you know what I mean. So, yay, yes for Team Edward, and nay for Team Jacob. I just want to know. I want to know where my chat's at. Nay. Yay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow, this is predominantly Team Edward. Nay for me, yay for Bella. Why can't we vote for team healthy relationships? I know, I know it's not a healthy relationship, but it's... <laughs> it's what it is. Okay, yeah, no. Edward is superior. Let's just say, listen, the only argument for team... Jacob is that he's hot. Like, literally, there, there literally is no team Jacob. He's just hot. That's it. That's the only thing that Team Jacob has is that he takes his shirt off intermittently. And it's like, okay, weirdo, why the fuck are you doing that? Like, when you're like 12, which is when I saw New Moon, it made sense. I was like, yeah, he plot wise has to take his shirt off. But then when you grow up and develop a brain, like, what the fuck are you doing, dude? Just keep your shirt on. It's it's not... It doesn't have to be like this. What do you mean he set her off? I... <laughs> team Alice. Well, yeah, but, like, Bella's straight, so you can't be Team Alice. Because she wouldn't be into Bella. So it wouldn't make sense. But what I'm trying to say is, like, I'm, I'm focusing specifically on Jacob. He sucks. Specifically, he does. And I... I don't know why people still have arguments for Team Jacob. A lot of people don't, though. They're just like, yeah, he's hot. There's no way Alice is straight. Yeah, it's weird that she has a boyfriend. How could she be straight? Like, hmm. How can this woman who has a boyfriend be straight? That makes no sense. What's a Twilight? You grew up on the uglies. I've never heard of that before in my life. Is it because I'm a baby? Whenever I don't hear a thing. Listen, this is the fucking annoying thing now. I'm at the age where it's like, I don't know something. I'm either a boomer or I'm a baby. It's like, stop making me feel like shit. What if I just don't know anything? 
I don't understand. Like, fucking the TikTok generation's hella mean to... Not even... Like, they're mean to boomers, which is fair. Boomers kind of fucked up the planet, not gonna lie. But, like, they're mean to millennials. And I'm not... I'm, like, in the... I am in the cusp between millennial and Gen Z. And it's fucking annoying because I identify with both of them. And then everybody makes fun of me. The fucking, the fucking millennials are like, oh, Gen Z, what a bunch of babies. And then Gen Z is like, oh, millennials, disgusting. Ugly's is a science fiction novel by Scott Westerfield set in a post-scarcity scarcity dystopian world where everyone is considered an ugly but then turned pretty by, oh my god. Ah, yes, beauty standards, the book. Ugh, no thank you. Hi, Cheyenne! Welcome back! Look at this old lady. Shut the fuck up, Emma. You're literally... You are literally mean to me all the time. But it's fucking funny, so I let you. And it's not fair. But anyway, Team Jacob doesn't exist. Those are my closing statements. I will not list my sources. My sources is my source is actually common fucking sense and that's that's it that's all i've got for you 2000 gang rise up that is weird to me that people are born in the year 2000 that is so fucking weird to me i'm sorry it just shouldn't be like this ever okay i'm done with my dollhouse now we did it and you were concerned about my murder room in my 50 designer i don't understand what what's the problem Sarah, I'm boner in 2002. Does that make you feel weird? The boner part does. <laughs> anyway, this is... We did it. This is the beautiful dollhouse. FGG front, absolutely. Yeah, uh, so we have the living room here. We have the dining room here. We have the kitchen here. We have the bathroom, the bedroom. And that's it. Those are all the rooms that we have. There's nothing else here. I'm just gonna call it... The dollhouse. Lot traits. Would I have any? Hmm. I would have it be... Not a mean vibe. I mean, there are a lot of challenges. We'll look at these. So maybe a quake zone. That would be interesting. And cursed. There we go. And then I'll upload this. No, it's two bedroom, one bathroom. Uh, time to write a description. Fertile. Uh. Whoa, that was pretty good. You turn 22 in 12 days. Congratulations. Happy belated birthday, Spence Pence. Okay, uh, what, what am I going to say? Um... This house is actually a massive dollhouse built with the help of my Twitch chat. Yay, I gave you guys a shout out. Thank you so much, Evil Candy Girl, for the bits. You still get mistaken for a 16-year-old. I did up until I turned like 22 and then somehow I just didn't look like a kid anymore for some reason. Like that's when puberty really decided to kick in. Um... Yeah, that's it. I don't have to tag it with anything else. And then, upload. There we go. We have uploaded the first lot that I needed to upload. And that is the lovely dollhouse. And there's nothing wrong with it. Everything is perfectly fine. I'm not acknowledging anything. We doing another build? Yes, we are. I can do one more build today. I don't know if I'll be able to finish it. Um, I'm trying to remember what I was supposed to build. I do remember what it was. This one is going to be an in the middle thing. Let me, uh, I just want to hide my game for just a moment. Uh, yes, because I, I don't want, I have to peruse my gallery for a second and I don't want to spoil anything. There we go. This. Probably a dungeon. No, no, no. This one is going to be real quick. It's going to be super simple. I can move back into the game now. 
I was mistaken for a tween up until I turned 19 and the depression started showing. Oh my god, that's so sad. Would you ever make, like, Halloween Horror Nights houses in The Sims? Uh, like, the the stuff where, like, it's like a haunted house that they they put up? Maybe. So here we have Janine's crack house from a Janine Christmas that was literally almost a year ago now, which is absolutely... No, no, don't do that. Why am I bulldozing? I didn't mean to bulldoze. Um, and we are refurbishing... Refur... Refur... <laughs> refurbishing it for Halloween which means we have to remove all the Christmas decorations and we're gonna make it nice and spoopy and for those of you that missed my announcement today you might be like wow why is why are we doing this well I don't, I don't know why are we doing this so, yeah, you guys are getting a little tease, a little sneak peek as to, oh my fucking god, I can't delete this. What's to come? That's what they said. Janine's candy crack house, a Janine Halloween? Maybe. Wow, I wonder what I said earlier. I wonder I wonder what the, the people, the early birds were there to listen to. <laughs> this and then get rid of this. There's a lot of Christmas shit in here. Like, a whole lot of Christmas shit. Is that every Christmas decoration? No, still not. What about outside? Yeah, okay. We should be good. I can't fucking see! Alright. Oh, no, no. I see ya. Let's Halloweenify this bitch real quick. Uh, let's look at... Does Seasons have anything? We have... Holiday stuff? Did Holiday have Halloween shit? What am I... Probably is just Seasons, then. Some left in the bathroom. Okay, I'll double check. I have to redecorate everything anyway. So if I miss anything, I'll, I'll just come back to it. I still can't... I still can't believe that Seasons was a pack. Ooh, that just makes me so upset. That Seasons was a pack. And I know I feel like, yeah, Seasons was a pack, but like, think about it. Weather was a pack. Oof. Oof, it just hurts. It really does just hit you right in the balls. Spooky stuff. Yes, it's spooky time. Absolutely. Janine's crack house looks so much better without the Christmas things. I beg to differ. I think it looks worse. I think it looks significantly worse. Some pompy cans here. Oh, the stairs are just straight up missing. Don't know how that happened. I'll, I'll add the stairs later. I just want to decorate real quick. <laughs> I ignore all of my responsibilities just because I want to build. Oof, those are big though. What about these ones? No, that doesn't look Halloween-y. <laughs> Weedy! No, the pack. What about the pack? Spooky day, bestie. Spooky day? Oh my god, this was a pack! When the fuck was this a pack? How do I not remember purchasing... Spooky day? What a dumb pack! I'm so I love spooky things. It was free? Oh. Never mind. It's a good pack. <laughs> oh my fuck. I'm a dumbass. Did you know? Did you know that my ass, specifically my ass, is really fucking dumb? Because you know, like, if you're, like, having a good day and you're, like, going ham, as the children say, they say, go dumb, go crazy. That's my ass. I talk about my ass too much. Just little tiny things. That's that's all it is. Just the little i I'm never putting a fucking spider. I cannot look at spiders. I can't. I can't do it. Yes, those spookies. The spooky day wasn't free for you. Okay, I guess it was only free for a couple of people. So, never mind. It's a dumb pack. Everything should be free. 
Not everything. Okay, that was... I just kind of jumped the gun there. Ooh, a fucking cauldron. Yeah, I'll put this out here. Fuck it. Well, she needs, like, lawn ornaments as well, because that's the only way that people get shit done, don't they? Evil Candy Girl, thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that. Oh my god, it's a little thing. I'll put this here. Oh, shit. Sorry, I have something to do real quick. Thank you, Snowy Queer, for the sub. I appreciate it. What a good time to be alive. You know, when life sucks and everything is just a fucking a piece of ass, and not even a nice piece of ass, just a shitty piece of ass, at least you are alive to experience this this streaming culture that we have where we go bop at the bot every stream for no reason other than we're really fucking stupid. And it makes us happy. <laughs> it's the Baba train, yeah. It really is. No, that can stay the same color. I don't give a shit. This is Christmassy. No fucking thank you. My gosh. I've never decorated my house for Halloween. You think I would, but I just never got to. And it's a vibe. It's like really a huge vibe. Like. Why doesn't everybody do this? Unless they do. In which I had no fucking idea. Where... Is that it? Are those all the spooky things? I mean, there's like this, but it looks too clean, you know? It looks way too clean for Janine. There you go. She can have a... No, that looks dumb. Scarecrow? Yeah, why not? Uh. Only decorate for Christmas. Yeah, same. time to be alive <laughs> oh man that's like my favorite part you guys really like that part too which i think is really wholesome i fucking hate the song sorry i'm going i'm rewinding i don't like it i don't like it please tell me schwartz will get a halloween costume but <laughs> i don't know what we're talking about who's schwartz i've never heard that name in my life like <laughs> okay schwartz Schwartz. Don't know what that's all about. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. Your first stream. Welcome to the stream, tired potato. I, too, am a very tired potato. I feel so fucking tired today, but I. Your girl's gotta get shit done. Put these streamers. <laughs> I'm a streamers. <laughs> What is wrong with me today? I get like, I like good. This is the sad thing. I got a good amount of hours last night. Like I slept. This is a Christmas table. No fucking thank you. I slept last night. Like a good amount of hours, but because I woke up early, my brain is just like fucking dumbass. And it pisses me off. Master of mediocrity. Thank you so much for the prime sub. You what? You love and watch your channel for a while, but you finally got Twitch. Well, welcome to the party. And even if you don't have Twitch, and I don't know why I'm saying this, considering you are my Twitch chat, so you you know about Twitch. Uh, you can always watch it. Uh, the vods on my second channel. Yes. By the way, just to say, 
Even though I did, yes, I did announce a Janine Christmas earlier this stream, and you guys are the only people that know. Nobody else knows. I haven't said anything. I mean, I don't, you guys don't even know when the actual announcement is happening. You guys are just getting in a, a little cheeky sneaky peeky. There is actually one more announcement that is coming, and you guys don't know about that one. And, oh yes, there's more, there's more here. Oh yes, I like this. So, um, yeah, you guys don't know about the other announcement that I haven't announced yet. So I just wanted to remind you of that. And I hope it um, stays in your brain for a while. You know, I hope you really think about it. I hope it really gets on your nerves. <laughs> Who are you? Where am I? Wait, this isn't you too? Okay. Sarcastic bastards. Thank you for coughing and sneezing. I hope you covered your mouth. Because otherwise, that's pretty fucking nasty. Ooh, ooh. Can I make these? Yes! Alright, we're getting rid of this. Look at this big window. And look how I just didn't let any light in. Oh, so nice and spooky. Oh, man, it's kind of nice to be back in this house. Like, I haven't seen this since Christmas of last year. Like, that's literally the last time I saw it. Because the last episode aired on Christmas. And this is like... Oh, oh, I see you, you fucking cheeky candles. Uh, this is... Like, OG fake gamer girl shit right here. Is Janine gonna get Cloud again? I don't know. I don't know what Janine's up to. You guys tell me! Listen, if people could tell that Kylie Jenner was pregnant because of her nails, then I'm pretty sure you guys can figure out the plot of a Janine Halloween. Like, they figured out she was pregnant because of her nails! I'll say it again! But they did that. So I'm sure you guys can be really big brain about this. There we go. Okay. I just... Ooh, it doesn't feel spooky enough yet. What am I missing? I need more spooky shit. And I'll look at seasons as well. What have we got? All. Lots of items. Maybe... Oh, yeah. I need to replace these. I think I remember specifically making these so that they had the Christmas colors. So we'll make this. Oh, that's actually really fucking cute. No, I kind of. Yeah, yeah. Maybe this will be the orange room. That would be nice. Vampire stuff or whatever. Do we need to see your nails to figure this out? I don't know. How is that a bit stretch nails? Oh, she is pregnant. Yeah, she's pregnant. And they, the people knew before she even said she was pregnant because of her nails. Like, think about that for a second. Isn't that fucking crazy? How, like, what's the point? What's the point of even keeping secrets anymore? Like, yeah, they're just gonna find out anyway because of the way that I looked at the sun when it hit my fucking eyes. I was like, oh my god, the sun, and they were like, oh my god, you're adopted? And it's like, well, I am? There's literally no point anymore to anything. No point to keeping secrets, no point to having privacy. The entire world's just gonna fucking figure out because why the fuck not? Where the fuck is my spooky swatches? I don't know what it was about her nails. She just had nails, and they, she had apparently sus nails. I don't, I don't know anything about nails. Maybe when Phoebe enters the chat, I can ask Phoebe, like, hey, what, what was the thing about Kylie Jenner's nails? And then she'll let me know. Or is it Kendall? Which one's which again? I don't fucking know. I'm such a pick-me girl, I don't know what the Kardashians are. <laughs> oh my god, you know what lives rent-free in my head? Fucking... 
Caitlyn Jenner singing Kesha. Have you guys seen that? I I really wish I could play that on stream because it's copyrighted music, but oh my god. Oh my fucking god, it makes me laugh. I'm such a pygmy girl. I have opinions. Oh my god, women having opinions. You really must be a pygmy girl. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm putting leaves everywhere because... I mean, the game is going to do it automatically for me, so I don't really know what I'm doing. Oh my god, I forgot about the floating plate and the floating bowl. Aww. This was like baby gamer girl. This was like when I wasn't big and... Aww, my god. Maybe I'm gonna look at fucking a Janine Halloween a year from now and be like, Oh my god, I remember doing this on the stream! I love how my mods straight up in the chat being like, I fucking hate women! <laughs> uh, what a time to be alive. Oh, this is really cute. This is so- it's like too cute though. It's fine. It looks grimy behind all this stuff. I can live with that. I don't really use the wall decals at all. This means that you're coming up on a year discovering my channel. That's crazy. The fact that people have been with me since the beginning is wild. Like, why did you sub? Why? Like, I look back at my old content and I cry. I don't cry. I just cringe. I even, I even, it didn't do that well, but I got a video of me reacting to my first videos. And it really, I, it was a very painful uh, experience to watch them back. I hated it so much. Okay, how do we feel? Does this look spooky enough? Maybe not the outside so much. Maybe we need to work on the outside. But inside, I'm definitely feeling the spooks the spooky vibe especially in the kitchen i feel like the kitchen was definitely the best bit change these is there an orange swatch there is yes uh fucking candles or something the bathroom doesn't really matter where's the chair the chair she won on danger island yes yes i need to put that in there I feel really bad for Bina because she got the wrong. She got the wrong size chair. They ordered it wrong. It wasn't me that did that, by the way. It was the, um, the producers. They ran out of money, and they they had to get Bina the wrong size chair because getting the actual full chair would have been way too fucking expensive. And honestly, it was really sad. But I don't think she noticed. So we didn't say anything because like I was gonna apologize to her and I was gonna be like, hey, Bina, listen, I know that you fought really hard for this and it's not even the right size. And I was going to, but she was like so excited. And I was just like, okay, yeah, congrats on winning. And she just took the chairs. Like she had to extra squat on the second one and like she didn't care. I was like, wow, she must've been really happy. <laughs> It's a foot chair. Yeah, I no, she put her ass on that. Forget how I discovered your channel, but I know it was before you came out of your shell, really. Oh my god. Yeah. It took me a while. And honestly, I feel like that happens with every YouTuber. Some YouTubers delete their old content, which like I have nothing against that cuz like as a as a content creator, I can completely understand. Oh wait, no, this is off the grid. I can't put I can't put these here. Um I completely understand because like it's really hard to watch your old videos like the one I have one video that recently hit a million views and it's one of the worst videos I've ever done and like when you look me up that's the first video that comes up and like my worry is like oh my god if people watch that and they like fucking hate it and they're like oh fake gamer girls cringe so I understand why people delete their old stuff but I don't because I don't care that much it's like my people will know that like oh you changed it's fine so off the grid but the grid is right there what grid where to go 
What happened to Becky and Brian Bumpluff? They got arrested. You keep fucking typing the same thing at the same time. <laughs> it's like me and Phoebe. We say the same shit constantly. It's fucking annoying. But like, not annoying, because it's really cute, but it's like, my gosh, we're the same person. We don't even have different opinions. Get you a friend that doesn't have different opinions. Except don't. Different opinions is actually really healthy. It's the only way you grow as a person. And, okay, so the inside, I think, is pretty fucking good. It looks very Halloween-y. Looks very spoopy. Can I change the color of this? To something that's not Christmas colored. Okay. Why don't I... Hold on. I need to replace a couple things, actually. I was like, this is gonna take me two seconds, and then it didn't. It took me significantly longer than that. There we go. And then we need to get her the chair that she won on Danger Mountain. Danger Island! That's the one she won. There we go, that's her chair. She worked very hard for that chair. We need an episode about Becky and Brian Bufflet's prison experience and their attempts at escaping. You know what? Where's my pen? I don't have one on me. I'll remember that. I'm sure I will. <laughs> I found your YouTube channel because of The Sims 4, but you weren't claiming to be a Sims channel yet. Good times. Good times. <laughs> yeah. It's a meme. I'm happy with it, though. Okay, uh... What's the debug cheat? Uh, no. Show hidden objects. That's so easy, and I just forget. Okay, and then we go debug. Look at me, I'm using the debug menu. Who is she? Oh my god. <laughs> and we go seasons. Da, 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 da. Oh my god, there's even more like... Oh, there's no Halloween decorations, though. That's shitty. Why'd you pick Thanksgiving or Halloween? Literally, nobody gives a fuck about Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving fucking sucks. Why is it not showing me everything? It's missing things. I want the pumpkins! Oh, did the pumpkins not come with- Did it come with Spooky? Oh my god, it might have come with Spooky. Where the fuck? Spooky? Spooky. There they are. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking pumpkins everywhere. Ooh, I didn't see these. I'm off the grid though, so that won't really help me. Spooky day. We need more pumpkins, yeah? <laughs> Found you after watching a video that was a little more wholesome. YouTube recommended one of your vo videos and I knew your personality much more my style. Hell yeah. It's so weird when people tell me like what videos they found me on because it's like it's just weird i don't really when i post videos i don't really think about new people i think about the people that are already watching me so it's just weird being like oh that was your introduction to me Oof! oh god but then i wouldn't want every video to be an introduction to me because that just feels weird i don't even know what the fuck i'm saying look at all the puppy kids they're so fucking cute they're all gonna rot though and it's gonna be fucking hilarious they rot right there's a big one. We've got a big boy over there. And then hopefully, uh, when I get in-game, I can... Oopsie. Oopsie doopsie. Maloopsie. Oh, why is it like that? I'm sorry. I'm gonna have... I know this is, like, not canon, but... Get the fuck out of here with that shit. Um... I'll have to set the the uh, like the the box decorations. This thing, this thing, it gives you decorations, and then you can have lights on the outside, and it'll be super cool. So that's Janine's done. I never remember the first video I saw people subscribe to. I kind of do. It depends on the creator, though. <sighs> Janine's water tower is not here anymore. Water tower. Water tower. It's a fucking debug item, and I don't want to sort through debug. Uh. Let's go through debug menu together. Let's peruse the catalog, shall we? You're spacey? You mean me right now? Because that's what I am. 
A hundred percent. And no, I'm saying this right now. I am not putting debug cat, dog, or baby, or debug rabbit. I've seen debug rabbit before. I am not putting them anywhere near any of my builds. So if you bring it up in chat, I will be very upset with you. And if it goes on too long, I'll start. I'll, I'll start crying. So we are no stop it us hello us hello no we are not putting oh my god there's something on my eye why do you do this the one time i'm trying to be dem fucking dramatic we are not putting any debug fucking animals inanimate fucking animals in my build it's a, ever ever you'll never see me do it that's the promise it's a fucking promise i promise you watch it Just saying. Why the fuck are you guys talking about debug baby now? So no Animal Crossing then. Fuck Animal Crossing. Fuck Animal Crossing. I fucking hate Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing fucking sucks. And so does debug cat. And dog and baby and rabbit. Look at these fuckers. No fucking way. Where the fuck's the water tower? <laughs> I really want the water tower! Oh. I haven't even really been paying attention to what I'm scrolling past. Oh, there's fucking debug chicken as well? Stop it. Stop it. Animal Crossing is great. I'm gonna unmod your ass. It's not a live edit object. It can't be, because I didn't know that cheat back then. <laughs> it's fine. Do I need the water tower? Why can't I just... Ugh. I can't type. What pack was it in? What pack did the fucking water tower come in? Bum, 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 bum. Ba, 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 ba. There's this one, but it's a lighthouse, so it's not that one, actually. I will find this bitch. I don't care if I'm off screen. Strangerville. I don't think it's from Strangerville, but I could be wrong. I just say things and then, like, disregard everybody because my brain just is just like, no, we're tunnel visioning now. Oh, I hate debug menu. Some people memorize this shit. And I, kudos to them, but that could never be me. Especially when they add new items. I hate when the game adds new items. And I know that sounds really weird because I love when the game adds new items. But I hate when they do it because then I don't know where to find everything in fucking build buy mode again. And I have to re-memorize what the fuck I'm looking at. Don't say any fucking shit you're driving right now. Oh, fuck you, Kirby. Tell me not to say shit. Maybe you shouldn't be driving. Have you ever thought about that walking? You want to add emissions to the air? Ugh, unless you're driving electric, I'm gonna have beef with you. <laughs> you're not watching me. Then how the fuck are you typing? How the fuck are you typing, Cribby, if you're driving? Cribby, that's not very safe. Yeah, there's a mod that organizes debug menu, but I would never put a mod in my game. Get fucking got, Cribby. I know, texting and driving, that's so fucking dangerous. Don't ever do that. Look, it's a different water tower. It's a, oh my god, it's a fucking, what is that? It's like, it looks like a food can for animals. It's not the one I'm looking for, though. We are scrolling through this together. Bum 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 I've played The Sims 2 too much that I know all of this. But I haven't played Sims 4 enough apparently because I don't know where the fucking find the water tower. This is so fun. This is exactly why I don't do debug menu at all. There's some rude at my house right now. What is what? Dude. Oh, you're in the car with my parents driving from D.C. to Long Island. Have fun! I've never been to either of those places. But road trip! Hey, everybody, we're on a road trip! Remember the last time we got into a road trip chat and then we died? Do you remember that? Good time. Road 96 is a really good fucking game. 
this water tower is nowhere to be found. Oh, no, that's not a water. <gasps> it's a tower, but it's not the water tower. We're in the eco living section now. And if it's an eco, I had a feeling it would be an eco living. Uh, and if it is, I'm going to scream because I could have quickly um, categorized everything. Standing Mitch and Stan for life. I love Mitch and Stan. They're so great. Lumber Daddy, you fucking hate road trips. I had severe car anxiety for like two years. And since quarantine, I've lost my car anxiety. So I'm right back to enjoying road trips again. And I love driving. I love cars. I love being in a car. I don't love cars, actually. I don't like cars. I feel like I should say that. I don't like them. Because I don't... I, I just don't. I don't have to explain myself. So... But I like being in a car. Now no more fuck shit talk. What do you mean by fuck shit talk? Don't answer me. Keep your hands on the fucking wheel. Everything I say is fuck shit talk. You can't be a car. It makes you over an hour. It makes you grumpy and bitchy. <laughs> I like it. Because I listen to music. Okay, I went through the entire fucking debug menu. And I couldn't find it. So I'm gonna... I think it's an eco lifestyle thing. I must have scrolled past it. This is so riveting. It almost makes me not want to get the fucking stupid fucking water tower. Unless it's base game. A lot of debug items are surprisingly base game. I think I got snob skin. Two snob sims in a castle I got off the gallery. And they both hate the decor no matter what I do. You know, I was thinking about the whole update that they did where... They have, like, decor preferences and shit. And it really made me realize. Because they do get upset when they're in decor that they hate. And it made me realize how less fun the game is because of that. People are just in a bad mood because they don't like your coffee table. Like, people don't do that in real life. And they're going to start doing cast preferences now. Now, I wouldn't mind cast preferences if it was like a turn on, turn offs thing, but I would hate it if they just don't like somebody because of their clothes. You know, I don't, it just feels like it's more obnoxious than anything. My hubby and I have been listening to comedy albums while on the road trips. That's literally all my boyfriend and I do because we disagree on our music choices, but we both like comedy music. So it just, it works out. Although I prefer my comedy bands to his i i don't like his as much there's something this is gonna sound really fucking stupid but there's something in my pants and i don't know what it is and it's pricking me and i don't what is in my pants like i feel something sharp and i really hope it's not a bug because i'll scream what is that Hold on. What is in my pants? There's like a twig in my pants. What the fuck is in my pants? <laughs> what the fuck? Sharp pee pee. Ow. What did my... I feel like my cat did this. Fucking hiding his toys until later. What the fuck? Tree pee pee. <laughs> Toenail clippings. That's disgusting. I don't go outside. <laughs> Certainly nowhere where there are twigs. Anyway, that was a fun distraction. What the fuck? Like, I just washed these as well. Okay, 91. Thank you so much for the sub. What did I do? I don't know. Ghost twig. Subscribe to OnlyFans. Yeah, you fucking wish. My favorite is how OnlyFans is trying really hard to separate themselves from, like, what OnlyFans is known for. And it's just the funniest shit ever where they're like, we're not only known for that. It's like, yes, you fucking are. Shut the fuck up. It's like me trying to say I'm not a Sims channel. It's never gonna work. 
Like, that's what I am known for, and that's it. I can't make fake gamer girl a non-sims channel. It's just, okay, I can't find this water tower, and it's really pissing me off now. So, this is what we're sticking with now. This is a Janine Halloween's crack house. And it's very cute, and it's very spoopy. And there is going to be one extra addition made to it, but that's not for you to see. So, I'll just put it as the Halloween juiced house. Uh, this will not be on the gallery. This will be for me personally because... Oh, oh, no, no, no. I want to save this. Halloween juiced house. Um, one bedroom, one bathroom, doesn't fucking matter. Okay, save new! There we go. So that's that one done. Wow! You like my other gaming videos? Don't worry. I doesn't mean I'm gonna stop them. You crazy? So, I think, I know I was gonna do one other build, but I am so fucking tired and I still have to go grocery shopping in like an hour or so. So, I am going to call the game here, but the stream is not ended. The stream's not completely over. I like sitting and talking to chat. Talking shit with chat is always the best. So let me just have that open there and just you and me, baby. How are you guys doing? Why did you get here right at the end? There's always one person. And I started like feeling bad. Like, oh no, I end my streams when people join, but there's always somebody joining. So then I'd never stop streaming. And that wouldn't be a good thing. We doing a raid always, 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 always. Chalking to tat, that's true. Thank you for streaming anytime. I plan to stream pretty often this week cuz i've got to get these builds done these the 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 i've got to get these builds done for uh in time for october so and i wouldn't build it on my own i'd love building it with you guys cuz you guys are really helpful and i think it's just really fun I want to thank you for something some time ago when i had a struggle speaking and understanding english i started watching your videos i can say that thanks to you my latino ass know much more than before of course i would just like to disclaim i am not the best reference for english <laughs> I, like when I type I try to be as grammatically correct as I can I'm a, like a bit of a stickler for that but like when I speak I speak too quickly and my brain doesn't really catch up with my thoughts and then it just comes out not grammatically correct so <laughs> but whatever helps what preferences would you want to see the sims for since they're so meh hmm I would I do want to turn on and turn off thing I think that's adds a lot of depth to the gameplay i think that's pretty important preferences i don't know why i did that so intensely i don't know in terms of gameplay features i'd want story progression i feel like that's really important i want closed worlds where like people from a different town wouldn't visit the town you're in because it just gets really fucking weird when like henford on bagley's obviously england and Mount Kamarebi is obviously Japan, and then just the people from different countries all the time going grocery shopping there every day. It's like, no, you don't. You can't afford the plane fares or the hotel fares. Kylie Janine pregnant nails. Yeah. People found out she was pregnant because of her nails. Also, for giving you major support for these interviews as someone with major social anxiety, it helps having people reading for you. No, that's totally fine. Anytime, you guys. I Because you guys fucking support me, whether you know it or not. Whether I know it or not. Like, you guys fucking watch me and watch my streams and my videos and, like, you literally, literally pay my rent. <laughs> the least I can do is be like, you got it. <laughs> you don't know what about our nails? I don't know. Janine is pregnant? No. Judith Ward in Japan every three seconds. Judith Ward at your local fucking park every fucking day. In one of my saves, I built a school. Obviously, it's non-functional, but it was just nice to, like, when the kids fucking go rabbit hole world, I like to pretend that they go to the school, and there's, like, a little playground in the back. And then, like, sometimes I would just switch to the kids, and they would just be playing in, like, the school playground with their friends, and it's, like, immersive. And Judith Ward is just there. It's like, why are you hanging around a school, Judith? 
Get the fuck back to LA. You just flew over to some other different state, presumably, to hang out at a school? Ugh, stupid. Janine should have a demon child. Every child Janine has is a fucking demon. Yeah, but Master of Mediocrity, I just want to say, you got this. And even, like, if you don't get the job, and I know that's, like, really shitty to say. I really hope you do, and I really think you will. You you got this. No matter what, okay? Janine is fucking everywhere. It's fucking awful. If you can make one pack, what kind of pack would I make? Woo! I would make a lot. I would definitely want... Because I don't... The thing with packs is I don't believe in making packs we already had i feel like everything that we had before should be included in the game minus like some wacky shit you know i think supernatural shit should be in the game i think there should be an option to turn it on and off so i know a lot of people want the sims 4 generations and i do too i really want a generations pack but that wouldn't be the one i picked i would want to make a pack where you could like have different time periods like you just had a setting in the world that was like, okay, we're in the 20s now. Okay, we're in the 60s now. And then, like, the entire world changes. And the townies are actually, like, people's ancestors and stuff like that. And depending on the time period, you can't do certain things, but then you could have other activities. And the food you would eat would be different. The stuff on TV would be... Like, I know it's, like, a huge pack. When the kind of not really considering that would be worth 40 in my opinion or $50 I don't know how much it is in American dollars but that would be the pack I would make because it would be worth the money it would be gameplay filled it would be furniture filled it would be creative sim filled and it would add depth to your gameplay and make the decades challenge 10 times easier to do without mods I've been putting windows and pools thanks to you. And this morning I put up a slightly sized up Grim Reaper room gnome at the bottom of the pool. Like he's looking up at Sims and waiting. That's, I like that. I like that a lot. It's $55 Canadian, $40 American. $40 is a lot of money for packs. Like that's a price of a full ass game that has been in development for years. Like most games. Uh, $40 for a pack that doesn't have that? I don't know, it's too much. So, being able to take away cell phones. Yes. Katy Perry sweet treats in The Sims 4. I am waiting for that. They need to do that. Cries in Canadian. I hope you realize how much you mean to us. I hope you realize how much you mean to me. Like, all of you guys. Fucking crazy. It's just, it's just wild. You need to go now. Oh, well, thank you for joining the stream. Li 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 I will read this. L Eliarosaurus, or is it an I? Iarosaurus, whatever. Thank you. <laughs> I will read this. Proceeds to not fucking read it. I have a question for you guys. By the way, I ask this question at the end of every stream. What game do you feel like watching right now? It could still be Sims 4. It could be Sims 2. Something that somebody's streaming. Textured hair kit when? Oh, yes. Let's charge people for inclusivity. Love it. Metopia, true colors. Kena. Kena's a good game. I've been watching my boyfriend play that. Or is it Kena? Kena. Kena. That game's good. Stardew Valley! Ooh, Stardew. Yeah, okay. Let's do Stardew. Uh, so basically what happens is at the end of every single stream that I do, I do a raid. And if you don't know what a raid is, a raid is basically... Hold on, let me type in Stardew Valley. It is when I take all of you guys... All of you sat there in your chairs or on your bed or on the toilet or in the shower, wherever the fuck you are in case of Kribby, she's in her car. <laughs> and I stick you in someone else's stream and it spreads the love, it spreads the support and like you might find your second favorite streamer, not your first favorite streamer because your first favorite streamer is obviously me. Uh, and usually I just pick a small streamer to send lots of love to and lots of support because it's really hard to get a fucking audience on Twitch, like really fucking difficult when you don't have an audience somewhere else. Like, it's hard to build an audience in general. Uh, give me two seconds. I just want to double check that these streamers actually speak English because otherwise that would be kind of difficult. Just give me a sec. Okay. Uh, I need this on. Okay, the music's back on. So I am going to set up the raid. Drive safely, Krippy. Yeah, unless she's not driving. I don't know where Krippy is. 
Thank you, Kung Fu, Kung Fu Kama. I appreciate the sub. Sorry, I, I don't want to spell this name wrong. Right at the end as well. Okay, so. The raid is starting. So thank you guys so much for joining me at the end or the beginning or anywhere in the middle or even if you're watching this on YouTube. Thank you, YouTube. Say hi to YouTube, everybody, real quick. Uh, just thank you, everybody, for all the support. It really means the absolute world to me. You guys are amazing. I wouldn't be able to do any of this without you. And just remember to go in there. Oh, my God. Unrealistic Gamer. Thank you so much for the bits. Get in there. Spread the love. Be happy and behave. But try to make people as happy as you possibly can. The raid thing is... I can't click on it. So we're just going to have to sit here and wait until the raid starts. Stop it. Okay. There we go. Wait. No. Okay. Sorry. Every My Twitch is being really fucking stupid. Thank you guys so much. And the stream... The raid is going to start in seven seconds apparently. Anyway. This is... <laughs> stream breaks right at the end. But anyway behave be good have fun bye bye there you go it should it should be working now unless it's not and then that will suck really bad